Okay, folks, it's the um, Nimmer Bee here. Um, the Chicago Blackhawks just got off the eight game road trip. Um, they went five and three on that trip. Um, so, pretty good numbers uh, for that trip. Um, there are some things uh, that I liked on that trip and some things that I didn't like on that trip. Uh, some things that I liked on the trip were um, that um, the Hawks were able to score goals. Um, that was obvious. Uh, I liked the way they were able to kill penalties at times. Um, I also... Uh, I liked how the, when they lost, they were able to bounce back. That's something they've done all season long. Um, things that I didn't like. Uh, a couple of things. Uh, number one, uh, the goaltending. Uh, Huey and Niemi both uh, struggled on this road trip. Both of them uh, struggled uh, on this road trip. Our goaltending and our defense uh, didn't really play as well as we've seen. Uh, through most of the year, uh, cause for concern, not so, mm, probably not at this time. You know, if it's if it goes uh, right in through this month, right into March, then you start to get concerned. But uh, you know, it was a grueling road trip. There was some pretty decent teams on that trip. Um, some of them like Carolina. You know, all of a sudden got hot. Ottawa got hot. Both of those were losses. Um, but the other thing was that, you know, eight games is a lot of time to be away from home. Um, I think the Hawks really stepped it up in last Thursday's game in San Jose when they had a 3 nothing lead disappear. I thought they did a good job of killing penalties um, and not uh, giving up so many second opportunities. The other thing was that overall this past month the Hawks had an excellent month. 10-4-1 uh, in January. Um, Looking ahead to the new month, um, the Hawks have six games before the break, and I'll show you in, right here uh, who those teams are. As you can see, at home on Wednesday night, that's versus the Blues. The Coyotes, watch out for them because they've been a big surprise this year. Friday, Saturday, a trip to St. Louis. Dallas, the Hawks have yet to beat this year. Um, and don't take these guys lightly either. The Atlanta Thrashers, they've got a pretty good offense. So you're going to have to make sure you don't take them lightly at all. Also, uh, it's also John Anderson's return to Chicago. Uh, where he won four championships with the Wolves. So there's there's that. Um, and then, of course, Valentine's Day, they close it out uh, with the Jackets. And then you can see it's blank because the Olympic break takes place. So, you know, there's a chance right there to get some home cooking uh, before the break. Um So, you know, we'll see what goes on, you know, before the break. I want to see them, you know, go into the break on a positive note. Knowing the fact that, that everybody in the league is going to be off for two weeks, that, you know, we'll see how, it, you know, things go. Um, you got, you know, four games at home, and the other two are, are on the road. So we'll see what goes on. Hopefully they'll add to their best home record in the league. I hope they can add to it. So we'll see how it goes.